one of the things I feel passionate about is accreditation. And I know that sometimes it can be a little controversial. There are a lot of practitioners who are, you know, very senior level. They've been in PR, uh, you know, for, for 20 years or more. They're not accredited. Um, and, you know, sometimes that view can be, you know, why do I need to get accredited? You know, why do I need accreditation? I've been doing this um, legitimately and very successfully for years. And, you know, I think it's a shame. I think that it's important for us uh, as a profession to really continue to advance uh, our profession that folks become accredited. And the reason is because more and more folks out of college need to become accredited. And if, if all of us agreed to a set of standards, which is what accreditation does, for how we practice public relations, there would be more broadly credibility for what we do. That's my feeling is that, that it's, it's essential for the long-term growth of our industry and uh, perception of what we do uh, all day long, that, that, that um, we are like CPAs in a sense, uh, that, we, that there is a standards body, um, there is a vernacular, there is a code of ethics, and all of that is an agreed upon uh, set of, of knowledge uh, for anyone who is serious about public relations. And so I would encourage even folks you know, who have been doing this forever, just go get accredited. Accreditation is something that, that you could easily own because you have been doing this for so long. It can be yours and, and even if it's just a box to check. What's really important is that you think about what it means for the new practitioners of public relations and the longer term uh, viability, longer term growth and advancement of our profession.